Well, fire over the Fox kicks off later today. Beth Lemke with the Neville Public Museum is here to tell us about their activities going on for today's event. Hi, Beth. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing great. Looks like fantastic weather for all the festivities there at the museum. It's very exciting. Great weather, great activities. Today we're open 12 a.m. or 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. and we'll have tailgate games in conjunction with Touchdown Green Bay Packers Hall of Fame at the Neville. This morning we are in the, the exhibit gallery um, and getting a glimpse of it and we're just very excited that we can be part of Festival Foods Fire on the Fox. Yeah, there's a lot of activities that are going on obviously outside, but you have so much more happening inside, right Beth? Correct. Not only are we a cooling zone uh, in case the weather does get a little warm and steamy today, but also we have our museum is completely, you know, open um, for visitation. We do have our, admi our standard admission fee t this weekend, um, but we are open to the public and we would pr ask for folks to come on and visit the Neville, take a look at our exhibits that we've got going on, as well as participate in some of the fun activities we will have going out outside of our doors, mostly, like I said, tailgate games. Now, I know I was there for the kickoff for the Hall of Fame, the Packers Hall of Fame that's been there. How has it been ever since it came to you guys? It's been pretty fantastic. It, you know, it is, um, it's been a really great opportunity. Um, it's wonderful to come downstairs and see Packers jerseys all throughout the first floor exhibit and then, then folks checking out the other exhibits that we have to offer. Um, agriculture, um, art, I was going to say, Agriculture to Tavern Culture, the Art History and Science of Beer opened three weeks ago. So we really do have a wonderful summer pairing of Wisconsin and Northeastern Wisconsin uh, subjects. Now, Beth, I know it's probably going to get a little busy there in downtown Green Bay. Is the Neville an okay place for people to park? Yes. Um, the streets are, the Walnut Street side as well as the Dowson Street side are, do have somewhat restricted access, but the museum is open and our front parking lot is open so people can come on down and participate. All right, Beth. Well, thank you so much for being with us this morning. Hope you have a great 4th of July and you can go to our website to learn more about the festivities today. Thanks, Beth. Excellent. Thank you.